So we have a cylinder which has a slit of length L. The column height is H. Width of the slit is B. We need to find what is the resultant force of reaction of water on the cylinder. So we have just seen the previous problem that if you have a small orifice of area S, then reaction force is rho v square S. So we are directly going to use this result. Now only thing we need to do is we need to find the velocity at a distance x. So we'll find a small reaction force due to that small opening. And then we'll just integrate to find the total reaction force. So in this equation, V is velocity of efflux and S is area of orifice. So therefore, reaction force from elemental opening of dx height is given as df is equal to rho V square into small area that is B into dx. So whatever water is coming out from this small opening, the reaction force due to that particular stream of water is what is df. So V we know at a height because the water column height from this orifice is x. So V square is 2gx. So we have found a relation between f and x. So we just integrate both sides and the variation of x will be from this point to this point. So this point is at a distance h minus l and this is at distance h. So limits are from h minus l to h. So we integrate that and this will be our answer.